The ongoing drama of SpaceX and its enormous rocket Starship is keeping the world on its toes with everyone closely watching for its next flight. Following the mishap in April, the FAA has finished its detailed probe one month ago. Just a week ago, we were all super excited and on the edge of our seats, thinking that Starship might finally take off. SpaceX, matching our excitement, had even fully stacked the rocket between the 8th and the 13th of September, during the expected launch window. It felt like everything was falling into place. However, our high hopes were soon knocked down. SpaceX had to de-stack the rocket because the FAA didn't give the necessary launch permission. The FAA said more steps needed to be taken before such permission could be given, leaving all of us in a mix of excitement and letdown. And now, once again, the FAA has dropped a hint suggesting a potential date for Starship's launch. But this whisper of hope doesn't seem to have sat well with SpaceX and Musk. It seems like Musk has had it with all these constant delays, and he's finally let out his frustration on Twitter. The head of the FAA's Commercial Space Division revealed that the mishap investigation from the last test had been concluded and said a license would likely be granted somewhere in mid to late October, assuming SpaceX makes the required changes. Before moving forward, SpaceX must address 63 corrective actions specified by the FAA, with 27 focused directly on public safety, highlighting the undivided attention to meticulous safety protocols. Musk recently expressed his fury over what he perceives as bureaucratic delays. A tweet drew attention to the impending review by U.S. Fish and Wildlife officials, saying, U.S. Fish and Wildlife officials have yet to begin a formal review of SpaceX's upgrades following Starship's first launch in April. This could push back the next launch window by months, which I know none of us want to hear. Musk's irate response was immediate. That is unacceptable. It is absurd that SpaceX can build a giant rocket faster than they can shuffle paperwork. This development comes after the April 20th, 2023 attempt, which saw Starship blowing up just over three minutes into what was supposed to be a 90-minute flight, causing debris to fall into the Gulf of Mexico and destroying the Texas launch pad. This led the FAA into a rigorous investigation, setting the stage for significant procedural and safety enhancements. Musk's irritation is understandable when considering that Starship is not just another rocket. It's a gateway to our interplanetary future, representing years of relentless work, billions of dollars, and the collective genius of the world's best engineers. Indeed, the relationship between the FAA and SpaceX has been marked by a series of disagreements and hurdles with the federal agency often in the way of SpaceX's big plans. For example, in SpaceX's early days, the FAA fined them a few times because they said SpaceX didn't follow some federal rules. This showed the tension between trying new things in space technology and following existing safety rules. In 2020, another big disagreement happened. SpaceX wanted to test their Starship prototype high in the sky, but the FAA said they broke some public safety rules and started investigating them. This situation showed the ongoing struggle between SpaceX wanting to move fast with new tech and the FAA making sure everything is safe and by the book. They said SpaceX went ahead with the test flight without the right approvals, showing the constant struggle between innovation and existing rules. Of course, that reminds us about the recent past memories, particularly the delays imposed on SpaceX prior to the first Starship launch on April 20th. This date was realized after enduring numerous postponements and frustrations within the space community. It reached a point where the anticipation of the grant of the launch license almost overshadowed the excitement surrounding the actual launch of the revolutionary Starship rocket. And this is exactly what's happening today. Musk has been pretty open about his frustrations with the FAA. He said many times that he's annoyed with how slow the approval processes are, especially when compared to how quickly technology is advancing. Sure, safety is super important, but groundbreaking projects like Starship also need some space to make mistakes and learn from them. When we're working on stuff that's literally out of this world, every little mistake teaches us something new. Starship, standing tall at 120 meters, is a wonder of engineering, doing things even the legendary Saturn V couldn't do. Weighing a massive 5,000 tons, this giant can carry up to 150 tons of cargo, or 100 people, opening new doors in space travel. But for Musk, this version of Starship is just the start. He's dreaming of a bigger, better Starship. Starship 2.0. 
Of course, a bigger rocket needs a bigger engine, and SpaceX is on it. They've unveiled the Raptor 3 for the anticipated bigger and better version of Starship. Major upgrades like this mean that engineers have to go back to the drawing board and tweak designs and balance things out to handle more weight. It's not just powerful, but it can also be built really quickly, which is crucial for keeping up the pace in the space race. The upcoming Raptor 3 is expected to make Starship a whopping 18 times stronger than the existing model. That's a lot of power. Starship 2.0 is going to be huge. It's expected to be much bigger than the Soviet N-1 rocket, which was a super-powerful rocket built to take people to the moon. To give you an idea, the N-1 could push with a force equal to about 45 meganewtons. But Starship 2.0 is set to be way more powerful. Imagine a rocket so tall it's nearly as high as three-fourths of the Eiffel Tower. That's how big SpaceX is planning to make Starship 2.0. SpaceX is poised to shatter numerous records if successful in the ensuing mission. It is gunning for the title of launching the world's largest vehicle, a title that undoubtedly resounds with grandeur and distinction. The title is a testament to the advancements and innovations SpaceX has introduced in space technology overshadowing the legendary Saturn V, the long-standing largest rocket. The associate administrator at the FAA emphasized the ongoing commitment to ensuring all safety standards are met and is hopeful that the comprehensive safety review will conclude by mid to late October. Parallelly, an environmental review by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service is underway to comply with the Endangered Species Act, anticipated to wrap up alongside the safety review. Despite the regulatory complexities, the journey towards the next flight is unfolding steadily, with Musk declaring Starship ready to launch from the Texas facility. If you enjoyed watching and found it useful, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.